the game. Oh, there we go. Haha. <laughs> oh, I hear you. It's so loud. I realized yesterday that the music was extremely loud, so we're gonna turn it down a little bit. In game. Hello. By the way. Welcome to. Well, still the music guy, I guess. We have all the colors of the rainbow. Oh man, it's getting cold here. Well, cold. Not really cold, but last couple of years have been so lukewarm in winter. Ugh. Now you're getting to minus 10 degrees Celsius. Ooh, so good. My nose is going to turn into some kind of dam. Dam of snot. Uh, so if I sniffle, that's because it's cold. Uh, Alright, music. Let's turn this thing down. Do I kind of hear? Can I make that little fireball quieter? Shouldn't have, but who knows how this game works. Make everybody aggressive. Oops, how do I? There you go. We're waiting on a wolf. Put our thing on this guy. Alright, where are we going? So, where am I? Library or archives? Okay. Oh, yeah. I remember. Oh. Is it I thank the gods that you are here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, that's probably a, a bug that the uh, exclamation point becomes golden again. And the Viori talks to the guy. Gotta set our loot filter. Now we're just gonna exterminate all these dog people. Dog people. They look like uh, like sausages, like with their with their color, like these <laughs> these ones, you know, like a grilled sausage. You know, sausage color. You put it on the grill and it gets the grill marks. They look like sausages. <laughs> or maybe I'm just hungry, but I'm not. So yeah. I ate two whole ass chicken wings with some fries. And I ate some porridge. Hell yeah, porridge. With some luxury on top of it. I put some honey on it. Mmm. It's amazing. The neighbor will never know that I took some of the chickens. Because I only eat one wing from every chicken. The rest I throw out. I call it role playing America. Or just in yeah, most of the world, sadly. Throwing out a lot of food. I, that really irks me. I think I've talked about it a couple of times on stream. Something that can really piss me off. <laughs> ah. Just throwing away food. Good food. Oh wait, what? This is another labyrinth on in its own right. I would build a library underground. Because we are underground, right? We came downstairs. We're in the basement. I guess these are archives, yeah. Okay, these are the library archives. Never mind. Why are the library archives so much bigger than the library? Why can't I speak properly? <laughs> I said library. I don't know why. How do I get there? 
I already forgot what I need from this place. But as long as we can just kill things, that's probably positive progress. And as soon as we can't kill things anymore, we are probably just lost again. What is this? Oh god. It's got this. Well, some of the readers were die-hard book fans, and they, that's what they did. They died. Oh, the first time we see the energy legion, god damn. Things. The ghosts and the game. Oh, okay. So, if just before stream, just before it started, like right before the game crashed, like it was just in the main menu and it just poofed itself. So I thought we were gonna have another crash. Oh. Okay, what's happening? This doorway is evil. Also, let's put more armor on this guy. I don't think I want to keep this. Because honestly, that's fifth that's uh, level one is ten percent fire absorption and fifteen percent physical resi. But I mean he's gonna get a lot more than that. At metamorphosis, more whatever. Like he's gonna get a lot tankier. I guess on harder difficulties to min max your tanks uh, defenses, you can put the heat shield on him for the extra physical resi. But I mean, his armor protection and his armor absorption is going to skyrocket. I'll have to see what increases on subsequent level ups on of the metamorphosis. Because it might be only the health and the elemental resistance, and if that's the case, we'll keep the 15% physical. But if the armor goes up as well, then I don't know. It's that necessary. At least on normal, you know? I'm sure it's only one point, but we can spend that one point somewhere else. Work towards our third wolf. Uh, let's look in the corner. Skeletons. These are blue skeletons. Because only the uh, royalty came down, could come down here and research these papers, you know. And then high blood, high born scholars and stuff. So they had blue blood, and uh, the bones took the color in. So they have bo blue bones as well. And also their royal guards and other stuff like that. Yeah. Fallen general. Huh. Back into the ground, you. You snot monster. Wait, are we going even deeper? What the hell is that giant thing? Oh my god, are we going to, through a portal to Klendathu? Bugs! Look, and the little ones are following the big one. Library vault. Okay, oh god, nuggets. Crypt worms! This ain't a crypt. Go home. All, your, all of you are drunk. I remember them curling you up sometimes. That's so creepy. Okay, so what did I, what the hell did I press to lose the? Oh my god, I pro probably missed a lot of loot. Apparently, I pressed something that turned off my uh, my magic. My it turned off. Oh, because I pressed Alt, I think. Because I screwed up. I thought Alt was uh, Shift. Oh, look at that money. There was a, a goddamn Ajat or Ujat horse or someone. I'm not gonna go all the way back, but you know. I need to take out these these keys, or just actually take out the key binding. You know, is there a way to clear a key? Um, what's Alt? Filter all magical. 
Right shift. Alright. I don't really want to... I mean, at one point I'll want to filter all magic all. So with alt... But, but alt would still show the uh, the relic parts and the money. So what the hell did I press to show nothing? No filter, target pet, item single, common, broken, single player only. I have no idea. Uh, literally no poison resist, so these worms can be could be danger. Oh my god, that thing is going to be a boss? Alright, people. Game faces. Scarabius, the Desert King! Ah, kill it! Big ugly thing. Where did it run into the. Oh god. A little thing eating my boy. Ew. <laughs> Scarabus, the Desert King. I thought it would be in just a normal enemy. It's like a bug mummy or something. I mean, it kind of was a bug mum. Spun little boys and little girls and little transgenders and other things. Because, you know, we don't. We don't hate anyone, so, you know. Those bugs could have been anything. Anything they wanted. Watch it become a normal enemy after this, though. Majestic! Not a single green or blue. Wow, what a great thing. Ah, uh, garbage. Mm hmm. Oh, elemental damage 15, elemental damage. Okay, so we could... <laughs> oh no, because the elemental ring was the one I threw away. And I sold it too. If I still had it, I would switch the uh, vitality one with the elemental one. And then this could switch. Yeah. I would gain some HP. That's okay. Elemental damage, white damage. Does the elemental damage percentage stack with this? Because this is giving fire damage to my pets as well when they are in range, so would this give some kind of scaling on that? Probably not. It would probably just the 15 would be just the 15 elemental damage that it would give plus 5% on top of that. Or we have the 10, oh no, actually, the 16 vitality plus 10%, that's 1.6. And 5% of 15 is less, but I'll still go and put it on because more flat elemental and, uh, you know, that's still more damage because we gained, like what, 7? And it was basically just 9.6. Plus I get some HP, I don't know. I don't actually know how the formulas of damage calculations are in this game. Like what scales with what, what affects what. And you know, there's no way to see this. Scroll of Invocation. Is the wall going to open? Because it kind of looks like there's a staircase. Oh wow, I got the uh, olive branch. Look. Oh, that was ugly. It's kinda... <laughs> ate its own doors. Oh, it's a tiny scroll. Elder scroll. Ancient papyrus is covered with heavy, ornate pictograms. Cool. What are these rings, though? They're all garbage. Ah. 
train of feeling. I almost thought that it was a mastery, it was thanks to the sand. But yeah, it was exactly what I thought it would be. We go down, we come up somewhere, and now we're at the pyramids, almost, but not really. We're in the basin. Oh, we can teleport back and tell someone that we got something. I actually know, because uh, Imhotep is going to the other place, so we need to meet up with him after we get the papyrus. Or the scroll, or whatever. And we find the harp equivalents. Found a bug. Wait, what? Hold on. I got an achievement called Found the Bug. Cleanse the library. Oh, okay. I thought that was the legit bug. Because, you know, the game was crashing. Who knows? Could have been anything. Quick. I must kill more my experience bonus. That might as well be a scam, because I don't know if it actually gives me more experience or not. Kill for me! Rest of noodles? What? Awesome. Oh, needles, okay. Honestly, a crest of noodles would have been better. Oh my god! A crocodile, man! Ha! Ah! Trillions! Gators. Or, I don't know. Reptilian mental. Are you kidding me? It's health regen. I... I firmly believed... Oh my god, that's a big boy. He killed my dude. Oh my dude. I firmly believed that they were... Like... Magic people. But apparently no, they are like... Myrmidons or something. Spear and shield. And all these is just strange requirement. Are you kidding me? I am sad now. I was looking for these guys and no. No, it's not cool. I'm disappointed. I'm sad. I am suffer. Because the scorpion men are going to be also strange, mostly. With their big ass arms and stuff. Oh, nice. I'm sad. I guess the jackals are going to be mainly, you know, they're going to be the ones with magic dogs. Although the croc uh, croco people might have some uh, magic, but who knows at this point. And who knows about the uh, the dune runners? I think these are those are just rogues. They are basically the cat equivalent of Egypt. Dune runners. Okay, that's the way forward. Crocodile man! With a copish. Oh, okay, okay, they have some... They have some magic crocodiles. They're very aggressively shaking their staves. It was nothing. It was literally nothing. Extremely disappointing. Oh, Jesus. Didn't see these. So, we need to hope for some rigid carapace from those. Also, I learned my lesson with these tomb bots. That I can just destroy my hands.
Oh man, my cat being an ass again. Wait, it's gone again. What in the crack is happening to the? Okay, so, so when I press all, oh, does that remove the chest indicators because they are also yellow labeled? And it filters magical stuff like. But I didn't press Alt though. I really hope it's not some kind of actual bug I am encountering constantly, non stop. So I like when they die and make that little <coughs> noise. <coughs> okay, let's check. I'm gonna press Alt. Are they still there? So I have no idea why these bone pile things and the chest and stuff, the labels disappear. Um, this should be a dead end cave because we already have the way forward, so... Uh, although this is... What? Is this a plateau? Some kind of hidden camp of the lizard people. Oh, look at that. Reptilian. No one's itching something fierce. Ugh. Come back, everybody. Oh my god, they have a big, strong, swift guy. He can just run us down, apparently. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. I killed him. Me and me alone. The big man. Hmm. You can't carry. You can't anymore. hold anymore. Oh. You can't carry anymore. What the hell? Feces! Wait, we can get the bow. There you go. We can get this coil. Your inventory is full. I thought that was like a bead. Our inventory is full. To go back and shop. We're almost level 20. The scholar stuff is at... Or the philosopher... Or what was the physician? Yeah, the physician armor is at level 21. No, my god. <coughs> I can hardly contain myself. I'm actually going to put that away because it takes up space and... I won't be able Just to use that for a while. careful so. where you put everything. Careful where I put my... Things. Okay. Oh, look, there's no range on this guy. Uh, I'll need another Traveler, camera. Come look at my wares. Ah! Too bad. Oh, is that all? Yes. I have to paint our uh, Greek tunic into some kind of Egyptian color soon. Maybe yellow or sand color. Yes. Ooh. These are trash. What about the staff? Well, compared to what I have, it's, it's also trash. That's alright. Trash becomes money. Money becomes artifact. Or different colors of my suit. Or not suit, tunic. Because literally nothing else is worth buying at this point. Unless you will be able or I will be able to buy a How they didn't disappear. Uh, like green items and blue later on. 
rares and uniques and so on. Oh! It recharged? What? something out there something big that prowls at night they talk of camels missing in the morning and caravans being attacked nobody's sure what it is but they say you do not want to travel these ways unarmed well cost me a lot of extra experience buff timer look at them they travel on hyenas Actually, these look more like frog people than the Cthulhu people. These are fish people. These are frog people. Desert frogs. Look at them run. Naruto run. Look like desiccated Yoshis. Hey, OJ. Hello. Oh my god. It's been a long time. Happy New Year, and all that ritualistic thing. Oh, look at that. Ancient head. Amazing. How have I been? I don't know. Slowly deteriorating. Just like everyone on this planet. In these hard times. Unless... Of course, we are talking about the top 10% or so. Same. Ah. Good times we are living. Alright. I think the... The prowling camel kidnapper dude is going to be the big scorpion guy, but I'm not sure. Jesus Christ. These guys are really Narutoing me. There are times for sure. Yeah. Yeah man, nothing nothing good to look forward really. It's just waiting, seeing how the world turns, <laughs> to be honest. The, the couple good things the per person can look forward to, they turn to shit before they arrive, you know? But, you know, as, as long as you can manage to not to drown, so to speak, everything will be fine, OJ. This is not the prowler. This is just a random hero. Okay, now I'm paranoid. Did I turn off the filter again? Really hope I didn't. Oh my god, blonde witches. And I'm gonna die. Or not. Don't <laughs> be like that? Yeah. Alright, is that a man? Oh my god. Every single shrine, but the one I need. I'm about to put up a bad signal. This is not the shrine I need. Apparently it was the shrine I deserved. Oh, this might be the one. The mad book. Nope, it was just a hero. It's basically just a, just an upscaled model of the normal hyena riders. The reason why it's a hero is because it's bigger. It's twice the size. Did I put the shield on myself? Or is that the battle marker? Probably the battle marker. It's not really useful for a mage. Yeah, I lived. I never die. I actually haven't died yet. Yeah, zero death already in Act 1. Playing with extra speed as well. Alright, 
it turned off again. And it turns off the uh, the component drops as well. So I have to keep an ear out for the drop sounds. Thankfully it's a very noticeable tinkle or twinkle or whatever the hell. Even though it's the drops on the sand, but it's alright. Hero equals big. Yeah. They are going off of uh, 40k orc lore rules. Oh, there we go. That's the big scorpion dude. He's not a hero, though. He's too big, you know. He's a villain. He's running like mad. He's dead. Have you ever seen a buff scorpion? Look at those arms. It's like a super mutant scorpion. <laughs> it's buff. Kinda looks wrong. Not gonna lie. I wonder how it came to be. Was the daddy the human or was the mommy the human? Or maybe it's literally just mutated. But I guess that was the quest scorpion thing. Beast of legend! Yep. I gained two skill points for that. Okay, I've beaten stronger enemies and I've completed more important quests. And this is the one that gives skill points. Okay. You know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. So that was the level up. So my stone boy gets inner fire. Gains some speed. And the speed goes up per level. Okay. Oh, it goes up by two at some point. At, from time to time. That's good, because the stone boy is very slow. Although the most important thing for him is tankiness. So, the speed is the least of concerns. Because his movement speed is the same as the dude's, almost. You can just go... Gotta stop growing <laughs> unless you turn into a villain. I mean, yeah. Because... You either grow big to become the hero, or grow obese to become the villain. Like in Spider-Man. That's why that big fat dude, I don't even know what he's called. He's the villain. And he snaps Spider-Man like it's nothing. <laughs> okay, so what do we spend these two on? And this is the this is the hardest part of the game because there are so few points you just don't know what to do with them. Damage absorption. Create a living shield around allies. So everybody gets this. And it doesn't have an expiration date, so it's not timed. It's just flat absorption. Although 78 damage at this point is not much to absorb. Then again, this one has only 228 health at level 2, so... Eh. Strength of the pack would be good. <clears throat> well, maybe I should work towards the green bar. Wildfire I don't really care about, this I don't really care about. What is this? Armor and fire resistance to everybody in the range. Yeah, this is another one. So if this gives fire resi, why the hell would I use the heat shield? That gives fire absorption. I could just have it passive. Although it's only around my character. Still. Okay, so I need... 8... To get overgrowth, that is garbage. And there's more, there's permanence of stone. I could have fire immunity so easily. And I also need eight to get to wildfire. And I don't use these, so that's okay. Or I could work on my third dog. And I think that's what I'm going to work towards. I'm gonna get the third dog. I think it should come at... 14 maybe? So next level is going to be 15. Hopefully it comes at 15. It's still 2. Yeah. Someone limit 2. Sadly. You have so many colorful emotes. I must alt tab to look at them.
Ah. I like looking at the different emotes people have. Jesus Christ, how many places? <laughs> Almost every single one is from a different person. You get around. Admirable. The dedication. To the watching. Unless you just watch them at the same time, you know. I mean, hey. If you have the uh, expertise at multitasking, then hell yeah. The worst time is, or the worst thing is when two of the streamers you watch stream at the same time and you're like, well, who's my favorite now? It's kind of annoying. Thankfully, I don't watch a lot of streams, personally. All the emotes, yeah. But well, I've been abandoned by my own people. Oh, they went up here to fight. Yeah, you can do it, people. I believe in you. Well, only the nymph came back. Classic case of all my friends are dead. But it's alright. That's why I'm a summoner. I can make more. Just do like you and fall asleep and ride the raids. Yeah, that's one way. That's a good point. That reminds me when I uh, quote unquote farmed some of these event emotes, like the 2020 and these whatever else events, the LGBTQ events and stuff. I just tuned into a bunch of streamers and just left my laptop. Just let it run. I'll come back later and see what happened. And the last emotes were unlocked for free. Well, I mean, electricity and internet bills still apply, but. Aside from that, it's free. Yes, <laughs> free emotes are best emotes, even if they are bad. No, don't die! I cannot resummon you yet. Oh, he died! Existence is pain. Okay, it turned off again. I have a feeling that it's bugged. The uh, item filtering is bugged. That is kind of annoying. Anniversary edition, my ass. I know for a fact I'm not pressing any random buttons. And there are no buttons to turn off the filter. So. Oh! Why must you always kill my tank? I might redistribute some of the wolf points and instead next level up it's going to be three more points into the core dweller. He's supposed to be the one that doesn't die and he's the one that dies. Because the wolves and the other... the nymph... They have dodge, so even if they get hit, they might just dodge completely. Screw power bills. I don't even pay taxes. Ha <laughs> ha! <clears throat> you didn't hear that. Okay, it's such a long cooldown. Although, there should be something to circumvent that. Yeah, the refresh. So that's what refresh is for. Ah, oh, you didn't manage your summons well enough and they died? Well, use refresh. It comes in three different flavors. Regret, acceptance, and anger. The other flavors were not approved. By the uh, Food Health Agency or Administration or whatever it is. Ah. Uh. 
So, for all I know, I could be destroying the uh, the fauna of this entire region. Just all willy nilly. Because my, my character is from Greece, right? And this is Egypt. I, my character never been has never been to Egypt. So I'm just running around and killing everything because evil. Maybe they are like natives, you know? <laughs> Although if they are natives that kind of justifies killing them. Because the character is also, even though they are from Greece, that her parents are American. She's just flexing her American genes. She's manifesting some destiny or something. Ah, more corn bars. Nice. Getting paranoid again. Let's look at the filter. Okay, the filter seems to be okay for now. I could actually just keep it on normal, and it's more noticeable when it turns off by itself. So I don't miss all the components and relic parts and stuff like that. Because it's fine if I miss a lot, a couple uh, magical items. I don't want to miss the good stuff like that. Zeus is Thunderbolt. But it's what's it doing in Egypt? Who knows? It should have been some kind of Egyptian mythos thing, but no. It's Zeus all the way. Okay, so this is some kind of settlement. That means I missed something. Thankfully, we have speed on our side, so we'll just run back. Also, what's here? Nothing. Oh, I remember the bone staves. And uh, it might be better, but actually, it's not because it's just 11 intelligence, not damage. Have you played this game, OJ? Have you played the Titan Quest? It's a very old game by today's standards. Came out in 2006. Very good game. Although it kind of aged poorly by today's standards. It also because it's not very detailed on your statistics. And for example, I have no idea what my uh, summons damage is actually are. Because I can only see the base damage, all the modifications and stuff. I just don't know. I have no clue. And it's kind of sad. Never even heard of this? Oh. That's not cool. You're not one of the cool kids <laughs> when it comes to RPGs. Or I'm more like ARPG, it's not really an RPG. Not a lot of role playing around. Ooh, Obsidian Bracers. Wait a minute. I have this already. God damn it. And I can't use it because my character is int based, not strained. Everything is strained. Alright. Money. I'm about to. Well, it's basically a fairly standard ARPG. Although I think it was you can't carry anymore. Re it might have been the first, at least the first popular ARPG that introduced multi-class system where you can have hybrid classes. And that was probably its main selling point. And it's also centered around Greek, Egyptian and uh, Chinese mythology. It's actually pretty cool. I like it. Even though I'm not a big history buff, I still like these kind of locations and yes? you can read about the lore and stuff. 
to be killing titans and things like that. Well, one titan at the very end of the game. The base game. Although, the expansions take you to other places. There's Ragnarok. It's, it's, it came out in 2006, but it, it received its... One, two, three, four... Well, if we take Atlantis as a full DLC, then its fifth DLC came out like in 2021, at the end of 2021. It's like, it's kind of crazy how it's still getting stuff from THQ Nordic. Which is interesting. I don't even know what else they're doing nowadays, but... Always welcome. Apparently Titan Quest is still... Have you seen that good for nothing love. servant? Alright. Another obsidian bullshit. Amazing. Okay, the Agent of Horus is done. What's it done? Aside from the uh yes, dual yes. class system. Uh, come again! Everything is box standard. You got your different rarity items, your set items. You are the hero, everyone makes you do their dirty stuff because they can't be they can't be fucked to do it. Like Leonidas with his entire army is like I I can't go up the stairs, please go and kill everyone. Thank you, bye. It's like okay. Leonidas you fat fat bastard. Although the normal soldiers just die in one hit to enemies anyways, so. It's the time of heroes, because heroes can level up. That was a cool kid. Is he always the hot kid? I mean, that's an acceptable alternative. I've never been the hot kid. I was being the... The strange one. <laughs> oh, jeez. Where did this guy come from? Who died and made the skeleton? Okay, now we can go forward. Is that... Eh. I think these either respawn or just recharge naturally. Over time. Which is kinda cool. Because if that's the case, I could go back to Greece all the way to the beginning of the game. And grab one of the mastery shrines. They just exploit it. No! Get back, dogs! Can heal you. Alright, it, it looks like it's not turning the filter off. Now that I have the normals enabled as well. Which is pretty cool. Hero AK Iron Boy? Yeah. <laughs> That's a lot of cases that's the that's the truth. They pretend they are defending the, the the big cities and the people. But in truth there's nothing to defend the cities from because the hero, quote unquote, already vanquished the evil in the vicinity, so all the soldiers are just like playing poker and stuff. And when the hero runs through they, they quickly grab their weapons and they stand at attention. Oh, we're ready for anything, hero. Go forth. May Zeus be with you, and so on and so forth. And their character is, even though they have intelligence as the main attribute, they're not a very bright one. Or maybe they are just a psycho and they just want to kill. And you know, that's okay. <laughs> it's been hard on us. Do they give me stuff? These monsters have made things hard. We don't have walls. We don't have city guards. And now, crocodiles that walk like men attack us nightly. All he has is dick protect. They give me stuff, yeah. Most of the time, I get the loot from the stuff I kill. Pretty good. Unless it's garbage, in which case I sell it for big gains. And uh, they give me experience points as a reward. And sometimes, for some random dude, I get two skill points, which is 
I think that's the most I've gotten. Actually, what did I get for vanquishing the Act 1's main evil? I don't even know. It doesn't even tell me. You, you destroyed him! I destroyed him, yes. But I can only check the side quests and their rewards. That is... Apparently I got a relic shard. Oh yeah, relics are another thing they like to give. A partial charm, for example, for this one. But I think the skill point one is the <clears throat> top so far. I don't think I got anything for the main quest. Attribute points. Bonus resistance. Actually, that's pretty cool. Although I don't know what that resistance went into. I guess if I unequip all my things I could see, but I'm too lazy to do that. So yeah, they give me... Have you heard? Stuff. A fierce breed of monsters has begun attacking our farms. It's true. I was unloading baskets of papyrus from my boat when I saw them. They crept out from the marsh along the river, then attacked our village. Okay. Apparently that wasn't a quest. Even though he has an exclamation point, so that's kind of inconsistent as well. It's an old game. <laughs> you must understand. Every year the river Nile rises. If it didn't rise, our crops would not grow. If it rises too much, our homes and farms are swept away. Not enough, and we starve. This is our life. There's some lore about Egypt and the Nile. You know, they just... Just kind of... Put these things everywhere. People can... Oh, Jesus. Learn if they don't know these basic things already. Well, it wasn't Moses who made the Nile dry up. It's a natural thing. Oh, look, a dream, finally. Probably something I can't use. Can so much thing as garbage free root loot? I mean, it can be turned into money, sure. My pets, come back. Reptilians. Hey, side quest completed. I got. Oh no, it's not done yet. Light of the Nile. They drop a lot of gold and stuff though. And you might think that 800,000 monies in Act 2's beginning is a lot, but it cost me about 600,000 to unlock my, Your my storage full. chest. <laughs> How is it full? I have a bunch of space. What is happening here? Man, why do I have this for example? There you go. This game teaches you the uh, the importance of hoarding. Hoarding you can so you can sell it. So it's basically scavenging rather than hoarding, but still. You must love material goods. You are the one who saved us from the reptilians. To us, you are the greatest hero. We do not have much, but please, accept this thanks. Venom sack! Wow. Awesome. That's actually something I don't currently need. Was this would do something like that? I mean... He did, you know, do those things where kids just died because... Fun, you know, for the laws. <laughs> Paint your doors with lamb's blood. If you don't... Someone's gonna die. <laughs> it's gonna be your firstborn. LOL. Lameo. Inventory grows 
I'm still going to get at least one more side bag. Probably at the end of Act 2, maybe at the middle point of Act 3. But there might be more little side bags introduced in the uh, DLCs and stuff, but yeah. The initial inventory is, yeah, small. It's peak Diablo. Your inventory is full. Wait. But that's okay, because we can just teleport for free. I call it the panic portal, because you can use it in combat as well, so you just run and you just drop it. Hurry! The monsters will be here! What do you want? Quick! Before I pack up! Wants to pack up while I'm conducting business. He's not a very good businessman. If he was a good businessman, he would be like, Take your time, customer! And once I'm gone, thanks. that's when he just bails, before I realize he scammed me. Now that's just, a good business uh, careful plan. where you put everything. Wait a sec. Do I even have anything that's... ...remotely interesting? Maybe the Molten Orb would be something that might be more damaged than the Sh Eternal Knight, but... Actually, it's not. It's not better. Plus, this one gives energy leech. Uh, I need Although, I don't really need that. Because I can just... chug blue potions. Who knows what's in them. But... It's probably like some... ancient battery. Because it doesn't give mana, it gives energy. So, who knows what this character is. <laughs> Might be a, some kind of cyborg. Oh my god. The golem in the water always scares me a little bit. I'm like, some kind of enemy is coming, but no, it's just him sizzling in the water. Which is a nice touch. Uh, there was a trader right here. Great. What brings a foreigner such as you to this place along the Nile? Might that thing be sold here? No. I'm looking for dyes. Farewell. We don't have any dyes, and there was a portal here as well. Great. I should have looked at the minimap. But I didn't, although it shows on the normal map as well. That do bust. Amazing. Oh! Is this... Oh no, they destroyed it. Whatever it was. Hail, good hero. Imhotep asked us to watch for you. Uh, just yesterday, this temple stood whole and complete. And now, temple. look, it has been ransacked by a Telkin. We did all we could to stop him, but we were powerless against the ancient sorcerer. I do not know what he wanted. Uh, there are many mysteries which the Order of Prometheus guards. Mysteries from before the War of the Gods and Titans. Imhotep fled when the Telkin came, escaping with some of the temple's most sacred texts. They don't care. A guy called Imhotep can only be a swell guy. He's probably not going to pull anything like the Imhotep from the movie Mummy. He's not gonna suck up our flesh, eat our eyeballs and stuff like that. Even though he looks like he's blind, because you know, he has no pupils. But he's probably not going to betray us. Probably. Oh, hag skin. That's the first time we got that. Literally skinned one of them just for fun. But only partially. That's how you uh, 
teach them a lesson. Pierce resistance and dexterity, all armor. That's interesting. Alright, another cave is coming up. A mysterious tomb. Okay, that's probably not the way forward, so let's go and check it out. Get more of these skellies. And we have actual mummies! into pixels when they die. That's adorable. They are completely identical to the zombies from Green. They are just a little dry, that's all. Which is good because at least they don't leave behind poo gas. Well, I would say they are a weaker version. Alright. Time to ransack another tomb because we have a uh, link mentality. It's like going to people's homes and break their shit. They won't mind, we are the hero. Oh, what the hell are those? Don't go there! I'm, s I'm still looting. Back. Ooh, Hardy Buckler. That's great. I <laughs> don't use shit. Ah, of course, it's three shelf. <laughs> There's some kind of joke there, I, I feel. Like he was a mummy, he was embalmed, so he was re -shelved. Basically, some kind of canned goods deal. But then we tore it apart. So, won't these people find out that I just literally steal from their dead and sell the stuff back to them for money? That looks cool, and I will never be able to use it. Oh well. It's like... Shepard in Mass Effect. You are a Spectre now. You can do whatever the fuck you want. Steal? Exploit, backstab your allies, it's fine. You have full authority, full clearance. You can do it all, Shepard. For the greater good. That's probably the uh, mentality behind all these chosen one or slash hero stealing everything they can, <laughs> they can just grab. Selling it back to the people, and the people are like, okay, I guess you're saving the world. But I'm not going to give you a discount. Because that ring belonged to my grandmother, and she was buried with it. And suddenly it's on your goddamn fingers! <laughs> I'm the law. I'm the law! And I pull out the, uh, that gun Judge Dredd has. I don't know what it's called. The Enforcer? I don't know. They just pump them full of bullets. Hell yeah. I am the law. I should rewatch those movies to judge that stuff. I liked those. Mastery? Battle mode. God damn it. I guess I do attack faster. 
Not by much. Oh, we're almost 21. And then I might be able to equip... Equip something cool. Although I would... Okay, I do have the dexterity for it, so it's okay. Unless I get the dexterity from the suit. Oh, okay. Good. Because I need 98, 96 dexterity. We have 98, so... I'll be able to get a suit that gives me a skill I already have. Wonderful. <laughs> I hope it gives an extra point in it or something. Otherwise, it's completely useless. We'll see. Soon enough. The hell are dudes? Oh, I remember these. The Dark Obelisk. So the meta with the Dark Obelisks, unless they changed it in the Anniversary Edition, was to wait for the Dark Obelisk to spawn all the little skeletons. Because each of those skeletons gave you experience, even though they were just summons. And after the Dark Obelisks ran out of the skeletons, then you kill the Dark Obelisk. <laughs> That's how you min-max the experience gain. I don't know if they changed it or not. Or maybe the Obelisk itself gives you less experience as it summons more and more skeletons. That's how they divide it. Oops. Come back! Let's see. Oh, I still get experience from these guys. But they were always a good source of experience. It's just a little tough to kill it. Because these things are... Unusually tanky for being spirit skeletons. Alright. Gotta level up. So it's gonna be the rock guy, I guess. All the way, rock guy. Gets a lot of HP. But I don't want the rock guy. Dogs! <laughs> Summer limit is still 2. Oh my god, that's great. So I guess 16 is going to unlock the third one. Or maybe I have to go beyond the soft cap. Well. That sucks. Let's see what this place is. Old Kingdom Ruins, hell yeah. Nothing I like more than... Ruins. Oh. Big guy. Oh. I really like the aggro range of the summons I have. It's a lot better than in Grim Dawn, in my opinion. Because you, your summons are aggressive in Grim Dawn as well. At least you can set them to be aggressive. And some of them are just aggressive by nature, like the skeletons you summon. But they always stay close to the player character. You can't carry anymore. A little too close. And if you're playing a ranged character, they might just, you know. Not do anything. You can't carry anymore. But oh, come on. I can carry all the things, although this won't help. Yeah, this won't help, because can't put them down here. God damn it! Oh, there we go. There's a lot of space here. Easy. I have to limit the amount of trips I take back and forth. Oh no, trap! Oh, 
Bring. You can't carry anymore. No, please. Ah, too lazy to min max the storage. Or Nile, actually, yes. There's a trader right there. Ah, mail. Even with this speed increase they introduced in the anniversary edition. There's still a lot of back and forth thing. Although this is completely optional, like all this money is not even going to be used probably. Oh, vitality damage. That's basically what I had before, but I switched it, so I don't care. Elemental Ooh Yes. Come again. That is a good thing. I lose 93 health, but my pets are going to be a little stronger, maybe? Because I already have more elementals, so... Percentage scaling! Yes. Hopefully that's working as intended. Because, again, there are no stats to look at, sadly. Because if it's gonna be used, big numbers go per... <laughs> the simple things in life. You're right, we have to enjoy. Alright. I don't need the tiny potion. Good. Good then. Good then. I'm gonna clear out this tomb and then I'm gonna check if I can... If I even want to use the... Uh, the unique chest armor. Killing these mummified hyenas. Why would they designate them as tomb guardians? I will never know. It was disabled again. What the hell? Egypt is a little buggy. And the worst part might not even be the, the fact that they resell their own ancient artifacts back to them. It's the mess I leave behind. You know, some evil necromancer just could just come in here and be like, Mmm, look at all this material left for me. And they even have their own weapons right beside them. And they just... They just do the necromagic. And boom, we have another Undead Demon's infestation on our hands. I really hope there is some kind of cleanup group tailing the hero. Just cleaning up everything, like in... I don't know. I don't know. I, it, there are no games <laughs> where it's explained what they do with, with this garbage. Like, what are they going to do with these skeletons? Look, this one is just chilling, enjoying the sun. Hell yeah, it's not even dead, it's just on his break. It was even grinning, although skeletons, all they do is grin. They're very happy. Because, for example, back in Greece, I killed a lot of boars. That's perfectly edible meat. Unless they went crazy, you know, like they got rabid or rabies or something. But if they were just random boars I killed, because why not? <laughs> then I really hope the, the villagers and the citizens... Oh, look at that, a fish. Oh, it jumps and, it, and then it, <laughs> it goes back. It doesn't even turn around, it just kind of beep. Come on fish, jump. Jump pussy. Jump! You goddamn tease. Anyways, I, I forgot what I... Oh yeah, the, the boars. I really hope the citizens... 
ate the boars. Oh my god, the master is fine. Quick, turn off all the things. Don't have it. Mono. Oh yes. Everything gets extra five levels. I can have three wolves. Okay, I'm gonna sit here and wait for the wolves to regen. <laughs> ah yes. Until I log out or die. This will stay active. This is how you play summoner. You find yourself a mastery shrine and, and you just sit there. Summon resummoning your things. And we have also these bugs out a lot of times. Like I can't see their level now under the uh, their tooltip. Which is kind of annoying. But it resummons them in order, so all three of them should be level nine. The oh no, it ran out. Huh. I think it ran out just in time because I still summoned the third one. Hell yeah! Amazing. Now we are unstoppable, killing machines. I just need to set them to aggressive. Although they are probably aggressive, that's also something there that doesn't have an indicator, but you know, that's cool. They all told me to destroy the current evil. <laughs> Sounds like a problem to the sequels hero. Maybe. Maybe the sequels hero fights against the, the you know, the plague outbreak that ensues because there are a lot of Unburied corpses of different kind, filled with vile poisons and stuff. Who knows? Maybe that's in Titan Quest 2. Big Pharma. I don't know. That was a bit close. Thanks for getting me out of that scrape. Okay, thank you. Give me a chain. Char charm of Endowment. Charm of Endowment. Great, I'm gonna sell it. <laughs> Oh yeah, that reminds me of the chest armor. I didn't go back for it. Oh, but we can't stop now. I have only this army now. And this strong-ass army. I keep thinking I missed something, because most of this is just running along the Nile. So we don't even go into the un unforgiving desert and that looks very flat. <laughs> It's just a long road, to be honest. We're just going to the next major city, killing everything in our sight. All in a day's work. Oops, I picked up something disgusting. Gross. I can't sell that for big money. Ooh, this looks cool. Look at that. Hell yeah, it's shiny. Sadly, it's absolute trash compared to what I have, right? Yeah, oh, well. <laughs> what the hell? He picked it up again! Get out of my life! Jesus. I'm not that penny-pinching to sell every single item. I'm sure there's there are people playing the game that way. They pick up every single drop and sell it all. Unless it's better than what they have. I'm not one of those people. I think there was a time where I when I played this game like that. I even collected white stuff. But that's disgusting. So. We don't touch the white. It's 2022. White is not cool. It's a despicable color. As I have a bunch of attribute points, so... My character could be stronger, but there's literally no point. Look at that. We're destroying them so fast the game stutters, because it cannot load them, so, uh, load them enough, fast enough. The death animations. Ah, 
And again, I'm just killing the wildlife. Because why not? I don't know why, but these... These carrion crows, when they die, or not carrion crows, whatever the hell they are called. When they die, they sound like monkeys. I don't know why. Alright, after this tomb, I'm going to go back and... Or maybe in the middle, because my inventory is getting full. I'm gonna go back and get that item. And then we're gonna look fancy. Ooh, Spectrum Matter. Garbage. <clears throat> I like the boats in the crypt. Makes sense. They gotta sail the Nile somehow in the afterlife, you know. It's not very safe when you have an undead outbreak, that all the people are buried with their with their servants, with their weapons, with their earthly goods. But, you know, they come back to life and. It's basically the same thing I'm doing, by killing them and leaving all their shit behind. You can just grab it when they wake up again. Budget issues, that's all. <laughs> it stutters so much though. Oh my god, that's huge! It's a dark spirit coin. It's killing my expensive wolves. Not my expensive wolves! No! I legit don't want to lose them. They were expensive. I had to wait to summon them. Did one die? No. Where is everybody's here? Okay. Oh, now I can see their levels, and one of them is level 15. What a pleb. Sadly, this goddamn heal doesn't chain to everyone. Okay, so wolves have barely any health regen. Kind of trash. Alright, people, how do I tell you to stop? Set the defensive? I don't want to set them to defensive, but basically we'll do, they will do the same thing. I get attacked and they go in. You have to just go in and just take it. Kill it! Arr! Oh Jesus, no. That was impressive, actually. It was just a random hero totem. But so much went into its death. <laughs> Spectacularly died. Imagine if that was your talent. What is your talent? I spectacularly die. Wow. <laughs> and then you die in your sleep when you're old. And it's very spectacular and it would make people cry. Because it, it, it's so beautiful and spectacular, but no one's there to see it, and you just... You just die. <laughs> oh, man. Getting into the weird things again, like to, yesterday. With the whole... Schizophrenia... Bullshit. <laughs> oh my god, the game is really having a hard time here. I really hope this is not going to be uh, like some kind of decline where Greece barely had any problems, Egypt randomly turns off your item filter without your permission or input rather, and it's also stuttering like crazy. Maybe it's all these cool items. Or maybe. Actually, no, it's not on my end. I only dropped 58 frames from like 160,000 or something, so basically nothing is happening on my end. It's the game. I can blame it. Thank God. Alright, now we need to head back. And collect our... our payment. Actually, if I look at this, not as a hero, but as a mercenary, it's a lot better. 
Because I, I I collect the blood money after everything I kill. You know, and if they don't pay me after the uh, the quest is done and all I get is experience, I'm gonna go into their homes and take what's mine. I'm gonna gather my payment. One way or another. And I didn't go back to town. God damn it. I forgot. I like how they are still killing, but I'm already loading away. <laughs> oh man. Mercenary main. Alright. Sell to this book, man. <gasps> oh. Well, I think I interrupted him. <laughs> he was doing something very personal. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes. Well, I'm certainly not going to buy anything because it might be sticky. If you know what I mean. I'm not even looking at the stuff I get. There's no point. Alright. Got some stuff. He actually doesn't even sell dyes. Be careful! He's useless. Alright. Just uh, careful where you put everything. 188 intelligence. You're pulling my leg. Hey, why am I clicking? There we go. 188 intelligence. Nothing completed. Great. That's am I going to get 188 intelligence? Please, please, have a look. Always welcome. I don't want to spend my attribute points. How, how good is this physician's robe? I mean, it looks cool. Certainly a lot cooler than whatever this is. A mantle of essence. Okay. I get more armor, less energy regen, less energy, more health, resistances. I mean, it's actually good. So, uh, uh, no, see them drain. I mean, I would get intelligence by pumping stuff into the bars, but... I mean, next level might be in the bars. Who knows? I always change my mind by the time I level up, so it doesn't matter. Whoa, look at that extra HP. That's actually not bad. Now we have some kind of tablecloth on our person. Great, this thing can be sold. For you, I will offer my special drink. Thank you. No one is selling dyes here? What the hell? I'm being ripped off. And you don't sell dyes, right? You don't sell. Planets. Yeah, you don't do you anything. Did. All is shape and ratio. He's a very sensual enchanter. All the shape and ratio. Mmm. I'm a physician. I role play now. Also, I want to see if I get an extra point in regrowth. No! It just gives me another one. Regrowth item. Wait, can I just have two of them? Whoa! But this one is completely unupgraded level one garbage actually it's not it's 300 hp restored opposed to 240 so it's a level two regrowth but it doesn't have the accelerated growth and it probably doesn't have the dissemination does it have it go over there nope it's a single target level two regrowth And 8 second recharge, which is basically like 6 seconds because we are 50% faster. That is trash compared to what my awesome regrowth does. Even though its base healing is worse, it chains. And look at that! Turned off again! Are you kidding me? I'm going to file a complaint. I'm going to write a 10-page 
complaint. Wait a minute. What is that? Is that a butterfly? That is amazing. Random butterfly. In Egypt on the fields. Just alone doing circles. <laughs> That's so random. I don't know why they put that there. It's just interesting to me now. Can we go in here and kill people? No. Okay. Well, I guess the hyenas are the boar equivalent, or the boar's equivalent here in Egypt. Because in Greece we had boar riders. Oh no! Look, there's another butterfly. Great. Now oh, there are two of them. Now we have hyena riders. Although that would make the uh, Naruto people the goats instead of the cats. But that's not true. Oh, I heard something nice drop. Disease, plumage. Nice. A plumage. If you want to be fancy. Oh my god, it's a hero! It's Maromar! And it's dead. <laughs> Hell yeah, my wolves don't even need to go there. They just receive a... Like a notice, like a forward notice that, hey, if you read this, you're dead. And they just die. <laughs> they just drop dead. They just know that two level 19 and the level 15 wolves are going to destroy them. I don't even know what the enemy levels are at this point. They're probably something stupid. 17? Actually, they're not that stupid. A lot better than fighting level 8 enemies with a level 16 character. That was kind of weird. But I guess the game caught up. That's cool. Is it a bird? No plane. It's... It's dead end. <laughs> that got dark. <laughs> I like that. Beggar's Quarter? Well, beggars can't be choosers. Oh, I remember the shadow goblins. Oh, they're here to come. Wait, first, take the quest. Thank you. Oh, what is that? It's nothing. The hero already died. Shrine of Mastery. Okay, which one of you assholes is level, level 15? Oh, look, conveniently, I can't see their numbers again. What? What determines that? Hello. Oh, conceit. <laughs> Why? Well, that's all right. I know that my uh, water uh, silver nymph and the cordwater didn't die, so I'm just gonna resummon the dogs. <laughs> the shadow things. They just melt. And I also didn't level my uh, my buffs, so they don't need to be recast. Because they also retain their extra level, I think. Look at my heal. Whoa, how fast that is. Amazing. Okay, last 12. Yeah, I can go. All these shadow stalkers, they're in the wrong game. Yeah, yeah. Well, I guess the beggars got what they wanted. Their slums back. Brave warrior, you have returned homes to the homeless. You have helped the lowest of the low, whom the priests will not even acknowledge. Please, have this. Take it as our thanks. Scholar's Ring of Life. 
Of course I'm going to take it. I'm a mercenary hero. Hell yeah. I also got some experience. Almost level 20. Okay, levels are speeding up again. Maybe the slowdown in Greece was because of the level difference between the character and the enemies. Ah, we are speeding. There's another butterfly. Looks like a worm on the ground. But when you zoom in, they grow wings. Real time. Oh, we're in Memphis now. And so are the enemies. Hello. Magic! <laughs> That's the second item that fell through the ground. Yes, now my summons are so strong I don't need to do anything. I just run in. What the hell is happening? Someone has my powers. Hello Memphis, what up? It's your boy the mercenary. Our chests are spacious and secure. Good day then. Your chests are suspicious. Alright, which way do we want to go first? Oh, actually we can't go this way. Look how cute this is. Aw, oh, they have a little pyramid on their home. Or maybe that's the police station. It could be both. Hello, Memphis. Oh, look at that, the jamming camel. Look at it jam out. These are some chill-ass camels. And also some chill-ass people, considering the world is about to end and there were monsters just at the gates and only one person was holding them back. And they are just standing around like, meh. Just another Monday. Mm. Monsters. Now Set and Osiris were brothers. Children of Nut and Geb, Sky and Earth. Nut! By destiny, Osiris <laughs> was the first pharaoh. And he ruled over the land with Isis, his queen. He taught us to farm the land. Isis is a terrorist and organization, and you dumb. But Set was Come jealous on. of his brother, and he devised a plan. Set built a beautiful box of cedar, and told Osiris that whoever fit inside could have the box. Osiris, trusting his brother, lay down inside. Wicked Set quickly closed the box and nailed it, then threw it in the Nile. <laughs> but it. when Isis retrieved the box, Set grew mm. angry. He found it and tore it open and cut his brother into 13 pieces, throwing them into the Nile. Isis again went out. She searched and searched, but found only 12. They didn't find the dick. She then took wax and with magic formed <clears throat> the 13th part. The penis! In secret, hidden from Set's eyes, she performed the rites and ceremonies so that Osiris could properly enter the land of the dead, where ever since... He has reigned, and just like Osiris, the first pharaoh, do all our pharaohs go to death. All the pharaohs have a wax dick, is what I gathered from this. Well, that's insightful. <laughs> Friday the 13th will never be the same again. Well, look, a mighty warrior from foreign lands. I'm sure you will find just what you are looking for. Your accent was weird, man. You're not selling dyes. Only dyes. Always welcome. Only dyes. Sometimes it is hard to remember the old life. When I do, it is as a sweet dream. That life, the life of a priest, was a good one. 
Cool. Oh, Zaza Monk. Of course. I am Zaza Monk, the high priest of Memphis. This is the second answer. in power to Pharaoh himself. The truth is, times are difficult. You see, what with the monsters and Pharaoh in hiding, many are beginning to doubt the priest's power. Uh oh. Backstabbing. Usurpation. If our authority is not respected, there is no order. If there's no order, people will panic. There will be chaos, and the monsters will take the city. Everything ruined. We have magic, but not enough to stop the monsters. Without authority, Memphis is lost. Egypt is lost. Uh oh. Politics. Oops. Some troublemakers have started demanding that we show the power they believe we have. If you care to help, there is a staff of legendary power. I would pay dearly for it. With it, we could preserve order in Memphis. We could lead. We'd have a chance. See? Uh-oh. Scum. All right. <clears throat> Let's just leave that man alone. He's obviously an upstanding citizen who has everybody's best interests at his uh, heart. Is that teleport? Here's the one. You there. How about the job in the Pharaoh's army? No, of course not. Nobody wants this job. Not these days. Of course not. Mercenary work pays a lot more. I take whatever the fuck I want. Yeah. For you. Pardon me. Have you seen a man by the name of Unas? He is my brother. <laughs> he has vanished. And I fear the worst. My mind read that a little differently. Unas. My ass. Anus. I am afraid Unus has gone on a foolish, dangerous errand. According to family legend, somewhere in Giza, a mystical guardian sleeps in a tomb. I fear he has got it into his head to try and find this creature. Cool. Wait a minute, did Unus go after the staff? This guy wanted what? Did I, did I not pay attention again? I was kind of yawning, but... Yawn happens. I don't have time for idle chit chat. I'm too busy. I suppose you'll want something that's sold out. Gods protect you. Ah, no dies. I'm sad. All right, Imhotep. You know there's a suspicious dude at the gate, right? And it's not you. This time. Ah, I am relieved to see you. Things have not gone well. Uh, we were horribly unprepared to battle a powerful Telkin. No one has seen one since the war between the Titans and the gods. But now they seem to be everywhere. It is more important than ever that we proceed with the invocation ceremony. Only the gods can protect us. Thank you for retrieving the scroll of invocation. Uh, now, uh, let me see. To complete the ritual of invocation, we must first collect the Eye of Chaos and the Hand of Balance. The Eye is rumored to be somewhere beyond the Fayum Oasis. I believe the Hand of Balance is in Giza. Recover these artifacts and bring them to me. Only then can we summon the gods. Uh, but be on your guard. In these times, peril lurks at every turn. Literally the plot of Diablo 2. <clears throat> I mean, you know, gotta need the staff and the amulet. Put it into your hoarder cube. And combine them. Summon big bug man. Kill him. Hell yeah. So that's where we're going. Gate of the Sphinx. And we can also go Gate of the Palm. Because yes! You can choose which part you retrieve first. But the Sphinx has the rebirth funding closer, so... This is where we go. 
Outer Giza. Ah, yes. There's some fresh water. We don't need. Hey, Bless. Goodbye, Mission Control. Is this going to be another song lyrics? <laughs> most, of the, most of the time when you do that, it's song lyrics. Experience, hell yeah, that's murder. Going to the pyramids of Giza. I always, I always liked going into the pyramids. It's kind of cool that you can just go there, and kill everything inside, and loot the actual pyramids. Hell yeah. Historical moment. Level up already! I like it. Just trying to write something. Oh, okay. One bullet is a lifetime supply. <laughs> oh, if it wasn't so dark, it would be funny. And you know what? It is funny. And it's true. No. Just like that, I can hold my uh, breath for the rest of my life. You know? I hold my breath until I die, so <laughs> I suffocate. Ah, uh, these things are funny. I like that kind of dark humor. Loot everything. I will do that. Although I'm not going to touch anything that's under yellow tier, magical tier. I'm a picky mercenary. Oh! Diseased plumage. Or plumage. <laughs> Whatever. It's not plumage, but maybe it is. Birds need to poop too, so they do their plumbing with their feathers. Makes sense. Used to have that bat coffins. Oh, wait, what? Oh my god, the chat moved. Used to have that badge, OJ? Oh, this. Wait. Oh, yeah, you don't have that because your account got fucked. <laughs> Well, sad times. Smallest coffins are the heaviest. Oh. <laughs> okay, that's dark. Is it because they are made out of lead? Or is it because they have a child force? I have no sympathy. Or empathy. Either or. Maybe neither. I don't know. I've been called a psychopath before, but that's a lie. I'm just... I'm just mad. <laughs> Her condolences? Oh yeah, he, he, he got banned because he was toxic. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, we're close! Now we have the bugs! And if you played... Reign of Terror before, you know, these bugs. That's right, a lot of the models came... Oh god, these are ugly. A lot of the models in Reign of Terror come from Titan Quest. It's basically the same game. Ooh. I legit attacked a rock because I thought it was a bug. I might have a slight PTSD. Bugs! Anyone from Buenos Aires? This bug extermination is for you. You're going to kill them all. Because the only good bug is a dead bug. Right. <laughs> Eat sand, then a tree. <laughs> Ah, what a, what a hardcore uh, nature preservative, or pres preservative, nature lover, let's just say that. Hitting on a tree. It's to die for. 
Are you reading these from something? Or you just know these from heart? Because if you're reading these from something, send me the link. Because these are good. They're only toxic to the people that needed it. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's like your opinion, man. <laughs> it's very old sayings. Sayings. I mean, yeah, sure, the uh, smallest coffin is the heaviest, yeah. That one was the best so far. For the wrong reasons, of course. <laughs> I like how now that I exploited the Mastery Shrine, I barely need to pay attention to their health, the summon's health. They can hold their own now. It's very nice. Ew, what the- oh my god! <laughs> well, I guess it went back into the nature, you know? The planet reclaimed the corpse. <laughs> oh. Have you guys seen the new Dune movie? Oh my god, a blue and the green? Random bone drop. Okay, what the hell is this? Persian Greaves. Strength. Okay, it's going in there. Hardy Coil of Haste. Okay, so less armor, percentage strength, attack speed. Okay, this will be saved. I already have a percentage strength amulet. If I ever do a strength build, we can scale that sucker so high. It's gonna be disgustingly good. You haven't seen the Dune movie? The new one? Dune. D U N E. Dune. Oh, yeah, OJ wrote it. I should read chat more. Dune was awesome, yeah. I really liked it. It was such a pleasant surprise. Because most movies I watched that were like. 2021 and stuff. Very trash. At least the big movies, you know. But this one, they did good. It's worthy. It's worthy of praise. Just like once in a decade. Hopefully they won't screw up the, uh, the second part. You know? But I feel like it's going to be just as good as the first part. Alright. We're almost ready to go into the pyramids. And take everything that isn't nailed down, of course. And is more than wise. We don't need white trash. It's literally white trash. <laughs> It's amazing. Kill! Kill! Nice. Someone really need to, needs to come out here with a... with a broom and just kind of maintain the place. It's getting kind of sandy. No one likes sand. Oh my god, they... They're still building it. Oh, let's go into the Sphinx. Lair of the Sphinx. Hell yeah. Oh. It was long, but then well done, yeah. Honestly, it didn't even feel long. Like, it went... went so fast. Even the talk of it. It was... it could hold attention. It's, it was so good. What is this deal, though? Arcane Purifier. Damage to Talkeens, damage to Titans. But that's not percentage. That's flat 50 damage. 
that is absolute trash. You don't even fight a titan for ages. This is level 22. We're in Act 2. What the hell? Why? Why does this exist? And there are only three Telkins in the game. This is so stupid. Oh well, we're going to store it obviously because it has some good good elemental procs. So I guess every hit either deals extra fire, cold or lightning damage, which is pretty cool. It is arcane. Taps into all the elements through science or something. Better watch it at cinema though. Uh, I don't really like cinema stuff. It's too loud. No. And it really matters where you sit. If you can't score a good row, it's gonna be a lot worse experience than if you could sit at a nice place. Plus it's a social thing. And Corona, and it's expensive. Did I mention there are people there? Oh, and the game crashed. <laughs> oh my god, okay. That is... Can I, can I launch it please? Hello? Steam was telling me that it's still running. Stupid. I really hope this is not going to be the running theme of Egypt. Egypt is my favorite goddamn part of the game. Although it's not the best, it's not the prettiest. Because everything is just sand. Look at that, we look somewhat good. You know, it's not four different colors and mismatch, mismatch bullshit. We have a theme, we look like toothpaste. Toothpaste color. If account is banned, did you lose a follower? Probably. The game crashed. I am starting to get sad. <laughs> I'm starting to worry. Oh, enhanced. If I edit in my YouTube videos, I could attract more viewers, but that's not the point of that channel. It's it's an archive. Oh, that thing is so loud! It's an archive channel. That's the reason I don't edit anything there. I mean, I still do the subtitles, although I only edit some of the auto-generated subtitles. There's only one video I manually made the subtitles for, and it took ages! So I was like, fuck this, <laughs> I'm not doing that. <laughs> I really hope this save is not corrupted. Because that would be... That would be 14.4 hours of playtime just wasted if this save is corrupted. Oh my god. IT LIVES! Hell yeah. Sadly, I lost my uh, exploited summons. Alright, let's back up a little bit. That is disappointing. I only have two dogs. Oh, I didn't use my level up yet. Oh, 16 out of 16, and we can only have two dogs. I'm not even going to put that point in there yet, then. So we need to go above the soft gap to get the third dog. That sucks. Alright, so what are we going to do with these points? Probably going to go towards permanence of stone. Yeah. Because that gives a lot more elemental resi. And it gives it for all the elemental stuff, so... Yeah, let's climb up to Overgrowth and uh, Permanence of Stone. 
Although I said I would put stuff in Core Dweller, and I really should because now it's back to level 3 instead of level 8, so... Let's put stuff into Core Dweller. Let's resummon the Core Dweller. After it re recharges. Oh my god, sorry. I gotta rechat. Also, you could remove my VIP, because I feel if someone is higher rank in the chat and talks, it makes others feel less feel lesser and shyer to talk. Maybe, maybe not, because, you know, it might make them be like, oh, this person is a VIP, so they have been around for a long time, probably, so, you know, this streamer might not be as garbage as they seem. <laughs> I don't know. You can keep your diamond. Okay, it came out of the wall, good. You can keep your diamond because you're not getting a sword, that's for sure. And you know why. I don't trust you. <laughs> I don't trust anyone for that matter, but still. Also, you could get your account banned again at any time. What is that thing? Is that a pog? That's a pog. Jesus. Animated pog! Poggers. All right, back in business. Oh, I might put the next three points into the uh, the Sylvan Nymph, so it also doesn't die in one hit. Although it it has dodge, it has fairly ah eh, twenty percent dodge. But the the good thing is they still have that percentage damage. Actually, the wolves lost the percentage damage. Did they never have that? Oh, this does the percentage damage. Yeah, the Maul. But the Sylvan Nymphs, every single basic attack does the reduction to enemy's health. And she attacks rapidly. Or he. Or it. I don't know. I don't care. No clue. About what? Oh, the pog Poggers? Oh, that's so Poggers, dude. Long time was on my other band account where it showed that this was followed since 2017 and now you're a nobody. Well, it's your second account that's a nobody. You know. Maybe maybe you learn something from that. Oh, these are the guys who turn into skeletons, of course. Maybe that's the thing that crashed the game. Animated! Okay, it's legit lagging in the chat for me. Or is it just that slow? Oh no, it's just that slow. Okay, never mind. I thought it was supposed to be faster. <laughs> Froggers. You're drunk and kind today. You're always drunk. But at least you're kind. Oh, that's nice. Maybe this year will be better than last year was. Maybe it will be better. Or maybe it will be total ass. But only time will tell. You know one too? Oh yeah, you have the... You finally have the, uh, the things. People leave. You're responding to this? Wait, my chat is paused. What the fuck? The set? Oh, what's the point of... The emojis? Ah... They, they bring color to the chat. I like them. They're nice. Even if there is no real reason to put an emoji or an emote or whatever... At the beginning of your, your message or at the end of your message... Look at these guys, these are grape flavored and these are... These are extra spicy. Look at that butt! Look at that butt! <laughs> okay. Let's not look at that butt, it's demon butt. And look, those are blackberry flavored. Oh my god, this one is presenting itself. Let's move on, okay? Before I have any ideas how to crossbreed the demons with my dick. 
<clears throat> what was I saying? Oh yeah, even if there is no real point to, to the emotes, they bring some variety and color to the, to the chatting, so feel free to put the emotes in. I don't mind. In fact, I encourage you. If you got your emotes, flex your emotes. That's what they're for. Flex them! While I look at demon butts and stuff, you know. For, for some reason. As a people arrive, yeah. People arrive. Oh, trap. Trap! Get away from the trap! No, oh, she's melting. I have emotes too. Well done. Wait a minute. Oh my god, did they remove that one? Oh no. They removed the one I was going to post. Oh, that is trash. I was about to post the toilet. Apparently it's removed. Dang it! Never mind, I don't have emotes. Carry on. Nothing to see here. Literally. Sadly. Man, that was my favorite emote. Actually, that's not true. And the filter is acting up again. Unfortunate. But... I would rather have the filter get turned off on its own than the game crash, you know. Oh wait, that's the way forward, we don't want that. We need to uncover that chamber and kill everything in it. You're a nice but rarely responding fellow, OJ. <laughs> it's been a long time since OJ came here. Honestly, it's been a long time since... I went to the Discord channel of, of JD. Is that still up? I don't know when I last used Discord. I don't really use it anymore. Well, we got more fruity demons. They are like Smarties. Yum. <laughs> are there black Smarties? There better be. Otherwise, I'm going to riot. That's the nicest thing anyone told you all year. <laughs> yeah. The year is young, my friend. Okay. This is a bad guy. This might be a little tough. Undying King of Nubia? What were they doing here? What the hell? Well, we sent them packing, that's for sure. You can't carry anymore. God damn it! If something can fit. Hell yeah, insulating butler. And golden fleece. It's only been 11 days. Honestly, it feels like it's been a lot longer than 11 days. I'm not gonna lie. What brings a foreigner such as you to this place along the It's pretty slow going for Might me. that thing be sold here? Might that thing be sold here? We keep that. We keep that. Keep that. Come again. Thanks, bruv. Actually, now we have to go to Memphis. Still up by JD, still on hiatus. Still? Jesus. He's been gone for a year now, almost, right? Hope he's doing okay. 
I guess life happens, you know. Why the fuck? Are these people? Oh, he's outside. What the hell? It's literally not safe here. Why are you? Greetings! Greetings! I have no regard towards my personal safety. Safe travels! Ah! What am I doing? What is this? Old resistance. Ha! Ah. Sell that. I don't have time for idle chit chat. I'm all right then. Says the man who's idly chit chatting the customer. Whatever that means. Oh, it's a it's it's a Discord channel. You wouldn't know. I want that star. I want to feel like Mario. You got a star. I never got a star. This month's been going really slow. Yeah. That's how it is. Kind of fits the winter, you know. Nature slows down, everything slows down. We have our fifth corona wave. Hmm. Everybody's back to wearing masks outside and everywhere. Again. GG. Gotta get the fourth injection. Hell yeah. <laughs> Maybe in th the entire year is going to be this deja vu. Everything is going to be the same. Only the number changes. Oh well. Let's not think about these depressing things because God knows that's what everybody thinks about nowadays. Because nothing else is there. That we could think about. Oh, I remember this ramp though. Hell yeah. Wait a minute, was the Sphinx... It had a rebirth fountain. Is this the actual place I need to come? You know what would be cool? <laughs> okay, not that. It would be cool if I could... Uh pin the quests to the side, maybe under the uh, minimap, so I could see what my active quests are. Because honestly I'm just running around, although there's a massive stone door. You know what we do with a massive stone door? <laughs> that. <laughs> As they say, no news are good news, yeah, but there are a lot of bad news, so... What an asshole, it just closed it and I can't move now. Please. Oh no. Ah. Ah. Please! <laughs> it's happening again. I got squished into the door. Oh my god, I got a runtime error. Pure virtual function call. What? What do you mean? It's Steam! What? Not even the game. Or maybe it's the game. It's the game. What the hell? And it crashed. Great. <laughs> Someone is calling me. It's a pure, pure virtual call or whatever. Or visual call. I guess the game got confused by that uh, door shenanigan. Thankfully, there was a rebirth fountain not too far. I have to start manually saving again. Jesus. Although that doesn't really do anything because you still, you still start at the nearest Before rebirth the fountain. So, rip that. Ooh, look at that. Oh, 
look at the cursor because it crashed again <laughs> oh my god oh my god if it crashes again we are going to take to google and search all right thq nordic digital arrow rocks unearthed studios and now i can't skip oh my god What's the point of a manual save? Well, it saves your state. So, for example, if you find a rebirth fountain, but then you're running around and you don't find the rebirth fountain and you don't teleport back to town, because I think it saves when you teleport as well, then it won't save. So, let's say you find something cool, like a rare drop or a unique, rather, and you level up and stuff like that. But you don't get a manual checkpoint or manual save nor a checkpoint, and the game crashes. You know. Then you know you reload, you come back at the nearest rebirth fountain, but that unique might not drop again. Hmm. So I, I I have a feeling that's the sole purpose of manual saving. Please don't crash. It crashed. <laughs> Saves inventory and XP, yeah. But yeah, yeah, res it resets your location, yeah. I'm about to reset this game. Okay, one more try, and then we go to Google. I can't skip the... Okay, now I can. It is so Before inconsistent. Before the light of the gods entered the world, there was only darkness ruled by titans. Booba! After an epic war, Let's watch Zeus this. seized the heavens and exiled the titans, seeking to imprison them for all eternity. There's the end, boss. The lands were cleansed and mortals flourished. But arrogance precedes many a fall. And even a god's prison may be breached. It's so low resolution, by the way. Everything is blurry. That was only one Gorgon. One. Your gods will not save you. Wow, so inspirational. Alright. Please don't fucking crash. Oh, man. So that blue guy with the big nose was the Telkin we already killed. So I guess he's out of the loop. Alright, let's go. Super duper! Alright. Cool beans. What did I lose? Okay, didn't level up. So yeah, we're, we're here. And everything respawned. Yeah, you see, I I don't see the ramp now. So that's basically lost. But this was saved. So maybe there are save points periodically or maybe in between map transitions. Because that's technically a different map because it's a different layer because we don't go down. I don't know. There's an option to save... Maybe it does nothing. <laughs> it's a relic of the past. It's an old game. For example, the hero guy is not here. Did I get anything from hero guy? I don't even know.
Stay away from the poo gas. Although, now I got a green staff, so, you know, maybe it's good. Oh my god, it's a pet staff. Sold. Even if it's worse than my current one. And it's not. Oh my god, and it gives me elemental damage. Or my pets, elemental damage plus 5% elemental damage. And we're going elemental with them. Oh my god, yes. You know what? I'm saving. Hell yeah. Even if it crashes, that is nailed. We have that. And it's lightning. My favorite. Super cool. Just resummon them for funsies. You know what? It might be <clears throat> the item filler. To be perfectly honest. Because it's turned off again. Actually, it's not turned off. It's not supposed to turn be turned off, but if I... But I had to press the, the hotkey. Filter broken, filter... Oh no, it was filtering common out. Okay, so it wasn't broken yet. I don't know, but that's that's my best guess. There's something wonky with this entire act. As soon as it started, things started going bad. Egypt is wonky. Okay, so what the hell is this? It's a sand trap. Now we're playing Tomb Raider. Yo! Yo! There's a skeleton! Hell yeah, Archer Lady. I don't care about being a bad boy with cheese. You're the big guy. I'll provide moral support. Actually, I can attack. It's an honor guard. It's dead now. Oh, here it comes. What are you fighting? Don't kill that one because it will just make this head more difficult. We have to choose our targets. And now we can just kill it. Because when we kill a statue or a totem, so we can see the ghost inhabits the body, it starts laying the smack down. We are super strong. Okay, let's wait for the drops to happen. And do another save. I guess this is my life now. Saving every five minutes or less. And just like a true mercenary, I first I go for the treasure and then for the objective.
It's the Horadric Staff or whatever. That was Horadric Cube. I don't know. Staff of Kings. Very nice. Now we need to get out of here. I don't want to fight through stuff again. But I don't know where the nearest teleporter would take us. Because I want to still explore the pyramids. If it's possible. It might not even be possible. I might be remembering wrong. Because I didn't remember the swings. I'm just gonna ram past everything. Which is sad, but... The game did this. Oh, look at all the treasure! Not even going to look. I'm just gonna keep my eyes on the map. Although I see a nice, a lot of nice yellow colors. Is that a? Okay, that's a battle marker. I would have stopped for a. Uh... Oh my god, it's already lagging. Oh my god. I would have stopped for a. Uh... Let's touch this. For a mastery shrine. Ah, oh, we are free. Tough crowd. Hello? Well, oh my god, look at this. The entire chunk is unknown. But not the chunk, not the the other chunks around it because they can see them. Yeah, something is definitely not working as intended. Well, I guess I can re-kill everyone. Oh, I never got the teleporter. Okay, now we can just bail. I'm gonna go down to these uh, crypts first. It screamed when it died. Oh my god. Oh, something cool dropped. Hell yeah. Set them to aggressive. Oh my god, okay, that's a lot of rigid carapaces. Carapes, carap whatever it is. Oh wait, Faeum Passage, that might actually connect to the other place. Because I think it all reaches around. Like these two. I think it goes in a loop. Let's go into the other part first. Missing everything. Oh, leaving. All right, Doge. Thanks for dropping by. It was nice hearing from you. Have a good one. Go watch Dune, the old one, and then go watch the new one, and then read the book, or don't. It's up to you, but it's good. And happy Easter. Hey, level up. All right, cool. So what did I say? What I would go do? do where I would put this? I think we're going up this to get the overgrowth. Yeah. 
It's a little extra defense for my dudes while my healing is on cooldown, I guess. Let's see if you get the time. I mean, that's the main thing, but I recommend it. If it even means anything. Alright, let's put just points in there. Let's go this way. Good movies are hard to come by these days. So sad. Wait a minute, is this another quest? It is! Oh, it's the missing brother. Oh, this is for the uh, thingy. Put down a panic portal because I don't know this. I don't remember this. Hello, anus! You unfortunate son. No! Hey, hey, stay back! Don't go in there! It's gone mad! It won't obey me! I'm gonna bite its ear to show dominance. You! Oh god, it's biting my ear. It's dead. It was undead, dude. Don't control the undead unless you're a necromancer. Which I am not, but almost. It's dead, isn't it? Oh, I had hoped to use it against the monsters. It should have followed my command. It was as if it was possessed. My sister, Tatari, must be worried sick about me. I should return to her. Nah, dude. Li live in the ruins. It's a lot more fun than society, I, I promise. <laughs> well, I guess that was a side objective. What did I get for that? Missing brother. Nothing yet. I'm gonna get a powerful ring. Wink, wink. It might be nothing but trash. Powerful ring. I hope it's at least a green. Let's save. I'm gonna have to paranoia save every two minutes. I hate it. Ew, and the little tail wiggles when it dies and curls up. It goes... It's adorable. I wonder what it tastes like. You know how many people these giant protein sacks could feed? Also, their face jumps out when they die. Blech. Or their mouth. You know, it extends out and just stays like that. Unless they curl up, of course. Back in 2000 and... I don't know, 9? Because it didn't play it as it came out. I played it years later, I think. That shit looked cool. Still looks kinda cool. Oh. Maybe just nostalgia goggles, but... But, okay, randomly stops. Even though I'm holding down the uh, mouse button. I like this skin. Gruesome Bone Scarab. I think they look cool. I like that green and... Like, dark grey and black. Nice contrast. It's like monster energy. Oh my god. <laughs> Hashtag not sponsored, by the way. Oh, I got coomed on. Three. Gather around, children. And now we are freezing. Okay. Is the heat shield the culprit? As soon as I put it on the golem, the game just took a second. 
Or maybe it was just loading the next area? Who Jesus Christ. We got a fountain too, so at least we got that. We don't have to run through that area anymore. I'm kind of disappointed in the performance of this game. I honestly don't remember the the old one, the pre-anniversary edition, crashing this much. I feel like it crashed a couple of times back in the day, but not this much. There's a settlement, let me in! Hello! Hey, you Moises! Ah, fresh water. Let's contaminate the water. Greetings, traveler! We haven't seen many new faces here lately. I don't know about any ancient artifacts. The only ancient thing around here is the desert. There's the Temple of Osiris, just outside the walls here. Be warned, it was attacked last night by monsters. No, now hold a minute. I have heard of another temple, ancient from the days of the first pharaohs. It was built into a cliff far off in the desert, but it is only a legend. No one has seen it. It might not exist. I forgot to beat the Giza pyramids. Hold on, we gotta go back. We gotta go back to Giza. Because if we can go in, we're going in and stealing everything. Pyramids must have loot in them, right? I mean, come on, it's a pyramid. And this one looks like it's not accessible. Leave me alone. Alright. I don't see any stuff on the minimap. Oh, carapace. You have no more room. God damn it. Should have done the trading. Oh, please. Don't, don't, don't crash. Ah, yeah, this one. Look at that. And there's a quest for it. We make our stand here. Monsters have broken in here. They must be stopped. If they defy a pharaoh's sarcophagus, terrible things will happen. Yes. If they defile the sarcophagus, then I can't defile it. I must be the one to do the stealing and the tomb raiding. I should have called my character Lara Croft. Maybe the next one. Oh yeah, your brother is okay. Everything I feared, but thank the gods, Unas is alive. You mean thank me? Bless you, stranger, for your help. That guardian was not our only family heirloom. Have this. It may come of use. It's a yellow ring. Chilling ring of whatever. Well, your family heirloom is... I don't have time for idle chit chat. Sold. I'm too busy. I suppose you want something that's sold out. Ah, let's sell everything. What is this? Hand of Balance? Oh yeah. We need that. Ooh. Wow! Rigid Carapace. 20% Pierce Resin. Plus 5 strength. Wow, that's garbage. Bye then, greetings. Come no. again. Where are we going? Oh yeah, Giza, right? 
Gotta loot that pyramid. Tomb of Khufu. He was a pharaoh. Far fairy. Fairy. <laughs> Fario. I don't know. I don't know how you say it in English. <coughs> Maybe it's the same. Oh god, I'm parched. Wow. I made farting noises with my mouth. Hell yeah. <laughs> It's almost been three hours, and I barely made any progress. Wow. Ooh, ornate stone door. Do we want to open it, though? There's another one. I have a feeling this one leads down, and the other one is just a dead end. Do you? Never mind, this one leads down. I close it. Oh. Okay, let's save and see if this heat shield breaks the game. And I didn't lag, so it must have been something else. Oh, this one leads up. Do we want to go to the top or the bottom? Because <laughs> I honestly don't know where the treasure would be. I don't think the pharaoh would be at the top, because. It's easy to... Oh, Shrine of Mastery! Yes! Yes! Be reborn, my kids! Oh my god, yes! Exploit! Until we crash again, of course. Cool cleaver. Oh, well, that's some kind of sword or a melee weapon. Yeah, we have a third dog. Oh, there's the sarcophagus. Great. I guess it was at the top. What if I defile this? Oh no! They don't like that. I'm just gonna blame it on the monsters, I guess. Staff of Khufu. Oh wait, we need that. We need that for the uh, suspicious guy, of course. It's completely peaceful, he's not going to do anything nasty or evil. Skull claver, bleeding, a lot of bleeding, and reduced armor. That's pretty cool, actually. Alas, it's not for us. What the hell, random zombie? Late to the party, I guess. Oh my god, it's huge! This great hero's staff is covered in precious stones and intricate markings, and a dusky sense of power hangs around it. I'm not a great enough hero yet, I guess. What if I just drop it somewhere out in the desert, you know? I took it, but I never brought it back. What's done here, then? No, oh, come back! Razor Claw? That's probably for bleeding. Something similar. Let's save because we got some cool stuff. Oh, look, there's another quest monster still. Oh, that's the real sarcophagus. What? Or maybe this is the... no, this is the fake one. And the monsters were stupid and tried to loot this one. But I went to the, the top floor and I looted the real one. So this might be a trap. Yep. Ah, it's a pool gas! 
It was fake. So Razor Claw Fierce damage. Oh, it's not bleeding. Bonus to all pets. Extra physical. Mm, I mean, honestly, this is better for my character. But this, that Razor Claw is, is better because pets. So I'm gonna make it. What do I need for that? Essence of Seth's Betrayer. Uh, Looping Claw. Scroll of the Stalwart Alliance. I don't think I have Seth's Betrayal. And also these claws, I think they drop from the hyenas. I don't think I have enough. And the guy disappeared. Where the, where the hell did he go? Guy! Did he run into the desert? No. Where could he be? If he could be... Maybe he's at the portal. did it. Kufu's Curse. Okay. I priest's request. Alright. So going back to Memphis and giving it to the high priest so he can become evil, I guess. I guess. Or I sell it. Because... Greetings! <laughs> Lame. Oh my god, 201! That's pretty cool. Come again. I need time to recharge, dude. Storage for the burden traveler! I can just do it really nilly. Nice! We have the uh what is this? The the Jed, the Jedi, the Jed. Okay. Wait, I needed this for this. Oh yeah, rigid carapace. I need one more flame. Do I not have any flames? No. There is the set of betrayal, and I only have one. God damn it! And I only have one of the claw. That sucks. Venom sack. I need one more venom sack, but I already have this, so it doesn't matter. Your goods are safe with me! Cool. Wow, look at that water graphics. Nice. Shall I believe my eyes? Is that the staff of Khufu? Yeah. Osiris, strike your enemies. I must reward you handsomely for this. Here. Uncle F Isis. Elf region. Ring and amulets. Cool. With this staff, authority. With authority, leadership. With leadership, Memphis yet has hope against the monster threat. Good intentions, bruv. Where is Mephisto? Oh, there he is. Or emo emote. Sometimes it is hard to remember the. Oh, it's the same guy. Oh. <laughs> Excellent. Now <laughs> bring me the other artifact and we can begin the invocation ceremony. <laughs> Does he say this again? Ah, 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 ah. No, say, say the. Ah, ah. Oh. Disappointing. Um, so I still have it on me. Okay. That's fine. So we're done with Giza. So let's go to Dam. Bam. Bam. 
It's true, the caravans have stopped coming. A Doom Raider chieftain named Iznu leads his tribe against all who travel the desert roads. Not for long. <laughs> Once I went into the desert, Scamp. I wandered far, far into the desert. Suddenly, there were stairs in the sand. I went down, and there were chests and chests of treasure. I couldn't believe my eyes. I reached for the treasure, and suddenly beasts charged at me from the shadows. I got out of there and fast. Oh, so that's basically the hidden hidden stuff this guy was talking about. Cinema. Greetings, traveler. We haven't seen many... My plans don't involve going back out into that desert. Not after my caravan was attacked. I lost everything. I was bound this way with a full. No way, what? It's safe enough here. Plenty of water. Dang it! So yeah, we need to we need to get the uh, this this Dune Rider boy. Wait, what the hell was that? It's a bird. What the hell? It's a bab. Who are you? Good to meet you. I'm glad to see a new face. Before the monsters came. Caravans were always coming and going. Our mo yes, it is safe here in Fayum, but it's lifeless. The priests say they know all sorts of magic. Did you hear the news? The Temple of Us. You could say that as long as the city walls st Ah, I can remember those days. When the winds blew. Ah, I... Ah, I... Ah, I... Can <laughs> I found another one. Once there were two lands. The Kingdom of the Upper Nile and the kingdom of the lower. It was at this time that Horus ruled the upper Egypt, and the wicked Set ruled along the lower Nile. When they made war and fought, Set gouged Horus in the eye, and Horus cut off half Set's virility. <gasps> Horus emerged victorious, Dick. and he was called Horus the Great. Set was exiled to the desert. The desert was dry and infertile because of Set's wound. And still, the light of the moon, which is Horus's left eye, is pale compared to the light of the sun, which is his right. I guess the desert is dry because Set got his cock halved. <laughs> no, I guess that's the gist of it. Or the gist of it. Enough immaturity. We are big boys here, so that's not the way I want to go. I think. What is this? Oh, it's just a cave. Okay, we can just go into the cave. Scarpos! One of the uh, Knights of the Ring Table, or Round Table, rather. Scorpos, Artos. <laughs> ah, that wasn't even funny. But I had a giggle. What the hell? Another needle. Needle shield. Manslayer. Well, I can believe that. That thing is huge. If it were any bigger, it would have been a hero. Or a boss. A.K.A. a villain. Okay, whatever that was, it's not good enough. Keep on going. Actually, this cave might lead us to the Scorpion King. I have a feeling the Scorpion King will be the second part of the main quest, so maybe this is not where I need to go. I can only hope that this is some kind of dead end.
Now look at that. That here, that thing has a lot of meat on it. And and protein just juices, you know. It's such a shame. Anything there? The wolves are going, so there's some enemy there. And the archer is leading the charge. Ah, the Scorpus. And the famous screaming black scorpion. Oh, yeah. If only I could summon these worms, you know. Like maybe the. Uh, What's we call it? The rogue or the backstabber or you know the poison one with the daggers. Maybe that could have like a worm summon or something because it shoots poisonous things, right? Could be cool. Like shoot a crypt worm. Summon a crypt worm from a crypt worm egg. Turn this game into an MMO and then ride the crypt worm into battle. Spellbound Charm. Uh, ooh, that would be great if I cared about my own damage output. I also think that the, the summons don't scale with any of the player bonuses in this game. But again, I think they don't know. There's no way to know. I'm sure some people know. I'm sure the Wikipedia this game has, because it probably has one. Or just general Google Foo would get me the answers to these questions, but... As long as we're killing things and not dying, I'm okay. Also, this is just normal difficulty for for now. So. so there's not a really well. There's not a great risk in normal difficulty of screwing up your own build. And honestly, I might not play harder difficulties, because playing through the game once, I mean, subsequent playthroughs on harder difficulties is just shinier loot, cooler items, sure. It's basically the same thing. That's why it was such a big, big increase in Path of Exile's likability, at least in my opinion, when they got rid of the uh, play through the game three times. And then you get to mapping. It's just play through the story once and get to the mapping. Although sometimes even that feels too long. Especially if someone plays solo. Alright, this looks kind of endgamey. Kill the Scorpus! Or not endgamey, but like end of the cave kind of deal. Bunch of bones, like what the hell are these? Big ass animals that left these bones. That looks like a dragon corpse. Are there dragons in Egyptian lore? You know, mythos and stuff. I mean, they have Sphinx. Do they have any kind of dragon kin draconic creature? Because I don't know that. Ew. Those big meaty scorpions. I mean, these scorpions could also be eaten. You know. 
lot of food. A lot of food. Mm. Look at this, it's huge! Imagine this ginormous thing just ba 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 It's walking around. Also, when did these guys get weapons? Wait, there was a hero? I didn't even see it. Well, I guess it wasn't that big of a deal. To my exploited shrine power up summons. Okay, that's, that's a lot of money. I feel like we get a lot of money, a lot more money in this anniversary edition. Then again, the stash costs a lot. But maybe the stash is price, the stash expense price is... Uh, like the first one you get, you, you keep in Greece, the small one, and then you increase it in Egypt because you will have enough money, and then you increase it by the, with the 500,000 in the third act, because that's the time where you can afford it. But look at this, almost 2 million. What am I gonna do? I think it costs like, what, 75,000? Their artifact. I think I'm going to stop picking up the yellow stuff. It would speed up the game a lot, too. Then again, I still find yellow stuff that's good. It's like better than the stuff before. Although these are literally the only things I have yellow. Actually, no. Coil of Brawn. Oh, because it has a lot of armor on it. Poison Resi, Fire Resi. Yeah, because these are shit. Meh. I don't know. These guys don't seem to have any ranged characters or magicians. They're basically just beasts. Whole scorpions, and that was it. Not even a. Oh, I guess there was a hero that just kind of died without me noticing. That's okay. Now we have to run out, and that's the problem. Or I could just teleport. I should just teleport because I'm right next to the oasis. So go back to Fayum. Cool. Yeah, it was right there. Weapons, armor, potions, bolts, and staves. What would be your choosing? Dice? A chance. Spellbound charm. Elemental damage. I'll keep this for maybe another character. No dice on this guy either. Oh, that looks cool. Oh, look at that! New kind of stuff! Awesome. But they sell basic white stuff, too. Why would you ever buy stuff here? It looks like it doesn't sell any... anything above yellow. It's white and yellow. Trash. Safe travels. Yup. Alright. Uh, this way, I think, is the Dune Raider. So I'm guessing this way is the way forward. Let's go kill the Dune Raider guy. That will probably be enough to level up. Or maybe we just need to follow the road to go forward. Dune Raider. They look kind of creepy though, look at their head. It's like... Eh, do move. They look cool, still. And I also like the footprints. 
I also like how only the entire character leaves footprints and the summons are just ghosts. Oh, what is this? Oh, what happened here? Another temple? Broken? Say then so. You're the one from Greece, aren't you? The one who killed the Telkin. Yeah. Would you believe it? A Telkin was here. A Telkin did this. Just yesterday, these pillars were standing and whole. I have guarded this Promethean temple from thieves and desert beasts. But I was powerless against the Telkin. In truth, I was lucky to escape alive. The Prometheans kept many ancient and precious artifacts here. But none were called. Whether the Telkin was taking revenge on the order of Prometheus or searching for something, I cannot say. I have not heard of this Eye of Chaos. I heard that the Telkin struck the Temple of Ptah near Seos as well. Good luck on your quest. Thanks. Oh, the Eye of Chaos wasn't here. It must be somewhere else then. So the Talkin is looking for something as it goes along its journey. Kinda of reminds me of the Traveler in Diablo 2. You know? Kind of similar. Hey, level up! Let's save, save. Oh. There's another cave. Ah. Oh no, wait, this is the guy. Oh no, it's not. I don't actually. I think it's going to be some kind of writer guy. The, the, the quest dude. But I don't know. All I know is that I need some, some of those claws. Dog claws. Oh, there he is. He just melted. Also, potions are so abundant. I remember needing to buy a lot of potions back in the day. Then again, that character wasn't a summoner and it was melee. Oh. Yeah, who knows? A lot of dogs. This is run into the camp. Wait, they leveled up, right? I should spend the points. My guys are still just going around killing. It's a, it's a feeding frenzy. They're just going. Alright. Can stop here and see. Oh, yeah, I am just going towards the uh, the whatever. What's this? Bayum Desert. That's it. Those totems give a lot of experience. So maybe they store the experience in themselves and thus they summon the skeletons. They, they store less and less. That's a ring. It's become an even more picky. Or an even pickier mercenary. Why is this door here? Eh. It's not like these maps are procedurally, procedurally generated. 
Grim Hatchet? I only picked it up because it says Grim. Reminds me of Grim Dawn. Oh wait, this was the hidden uh, place. The treasures and the monsters and stuff. Ah. Cool. I just kind of don't really care. <laughs> Picking up all that stuff. Ooh, Dune Raider pack. Pack of spirit. It has a bunch of alcohol in it. I guess this is the way to go. Follow the road, huh? What, what's up there? I must know! Oh, that poor tree. It's dead. Even if I don't pick up all the loot anymore, I must uncover. Probably just camps and stuff. I'll pick up the rings because they are, you know, they only take one square. Of inventory space. It's like... A million nine hundred thousand. Oh, this is the scorpion game. I guess we can do this. This is a dead end. I almost died, what the hell? Era Bone Carver! Goodbye. Bling. Oh, this is so cool, this is on the back of the, uh, the case I have for the game. In this fight, there's a picture of it. Go! Fuck up, Nehebaku. Nehebaku. Alright, he's aggroed on me. That's good. Ha! What a dumbass. Well, it's something, but nothing cool came out of that. As the AI of chaos. Well, I think it broke. It's probably fine, right? It looks so cool. A wild fire burns in the heart of the luminous green stone. Put it together. Staff of Finnis. It's garbage, I can already tell. Like, what even is this? A kind of ghost fog coming out of them. Wow. Temple of Atum. Atum. Well, that was that, I guess. Now we can give Imhotep his stuff, so he can become an evil guy. He can be like, yes, now I can summon the uh, destroyer of universes and the ender of stuff. No more sequels, what the hell is that? Defeat Nehebka. Oh yeah, because he was the Scorpion King, so no more sequels. Because we killed the Scorpion King. Oh wow, whoever made these achievements for the game was very funny. Funny guy. Or maybe there's not going to be a Titan Quest 2 because... This is why. <laughs> They're just going to keep adding on to it. Oh, 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 I need that. 
Hell yeah. I need three more. Alright, let's stab these guys that the raider guy is dead. Then we can just run back to uh, Memphis or Giza or whatever. So yeah, it's going to loop around. But it's a big loop. Because this is where it comes back. Then we give him the stuff, door opens, every, everything goes to shit, and then we can go forward. Yeah. At least that's what I think will happen. Any pet stuff? Nope. Got a claw. What is this? Oh, that's the elemental stuff. We, we keep that. Yes. Farewell. Alright, who's the asshole that needed the UR? Isnu, the Doom Raider chieftain, defeated? If it's true, that's the first good news I've heard in days. We'll send an envoy to Memphis. We'll have trade again by the next moon. Next moon never comes. 12,000 experience and everybody's happy now. You killed the cursed Dune Raiders, did you? I would have paid you handsomely. Only... It was not a rumor. The temple was real. Real? You found the treasure in that tomb? That treasure was mine! Dun, 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 dun. I mean, I left half of it there, buddy. Don't worry about it. If you go out there, you can take it. Honestly, don't really need that treasure. Good to meet you. I'm the storyteller guy. Oh, there's another gate here. Pretty cool place. Pretty cool place. All right, let's follow the road. Mostly. Mm-hmm. There might be something here, although it looks like it's rocks. Survey says it's rocks. Okay. Guess we're going this way. Oh no, more black things. Whispering. Oh, is this going to literally be a loop-de-loop? -loop? It kind of looks like this is very... You're intended to come from this way. Maybe. Maybe. Although it really doesn't matter. A light kopesh. Braces of recovery. We broke two million monies. Jesus. Did I get another claw? Nice. Isn't that guy some kind of world famous streamer? Who's also some kind of famous CSGO dude? Shroud. It's probably not shrouded in mystery. There's another cave. 
big ass meat worms. Oh, a natural cave. Oh, yes, of course. Oh, what's this? Nice. Vitality damage. What a necromancer. armor and we hit. Oh! Soul render! Sartor! Alright, well, he's nice gone. Coil, mantle. Convenient looking natural cave. Four little extra rooms. Are we walking into a sandstorm? I just want to die. Visibility is low. Oh, never mind. Visibility is back. Ooh, a frost framia fr from our something. A spear. Can't use it. Very squishy, holy, holy balls. Oh, that's the way forward. What's in this corner? Wait a minute, does it get nighttime when we come up here and does it get daytime when we come here? Oh, it does. Oh yeah, I, I forget, that's how they did the uh, day and night cycle. Oh wait, no, that's not how they did it. Back in Greece, day and night cycle was it going on its own, right? Did I not notice the trickery? Not sure anymore. But there's probably going to be nothing important at the plateau here. Already got the quest items, already did the uh, side quests. Couple ants. Being slurped into the ground. I don't need that coil. Ooh, majestic chest. That's some. That's some big ass thing. Send queen, not my queen. I want to protect myself from the fire now. Oh boy! Oh Jesus! Throw! Ah, it wants me. I can just do the cheese. Lol! You suck! Get out of the fire, boys! What the hell? It's dead. I lost the wolf. <laughs> uh, at least that's the greaves and not the bracers, so that's actually good because it's the second piece of the set. Ooh, vitality. Um, I think I want to keep them on elemental. Is elemental? Deals a little of each element, right? Or maybe it alternates. 
So that's still more versatile than just vitality. So I'm gonna keep the um, tool stuff. And I don't really care about the offensive ability for myself. Dodge attacks, no. I face every attack head on like a man. A manly man. Of manliness. Yeah. That's why I was running around the Firebird. Like a man. <laughs> was a distraction tactic. Yes. That's how I could minimize my losses to only one wolf. Instead of death. Out there on the dunes. I gotta check this. Oh shit, I alt-tabbed. Find and defeat the Sandwing Queen. Oh, it took it a while to give me the achievement. Somebody drop something cool. Oh. Wow, missing that one wolf really shows. That sucks. The damage output is gone. I might need to level up the mauling, although it doesn't do much, you kind of trash. Oh wait, actually no. Next level we can get the uh, overgrowth. Yeah, but I, I'll get overgrowth first and then permanence of stone. 5% elemental resi. I mean, it's not bad. And overgrowth is kind of trash as well. Everything seems trash. But when you think about how low HP these guys are, actually no, 581. And the thousand. The only low HP is this because level 2. I might just pump all the points into our growth from now on. Level 1, level 2 nymph. But maxed out abilities. Uh, that might be the play. Because our damage scales. I just. Where are my wolves? Come on. Experienced stutter. Gotta save immediately. Oh, well, there's literally nothing here. It was only just the Sand Queen. Doing whatever. Elos, Teslos. Whoa, lightning sword. A lightning dagger, more like. More damage to devices, okay. Odd, but okay. God. Somebody sending down the skies. Okay, I need one more claw. I think. Yep. But I also need Seth's uh, betrayal, so. Even if I get all the claws, it doesn't really matter. Oh look, there's the thing, there's the... There's the pyramids. How about that? What's this way? Another tomb, nice. That is disgusting.
Next show with the doomed prophet. Dead. Oh, mechanical parts. Nice. Love to see it. All of them were trapped. A lot faster now that I don't have to constantly go back and forth. Oh, big starter. Not happy about that. I'm getting tired though. I need some sleep. I need about four hours of sleep, please. I need my sleep. I'm going to fall off the chair to the ground. Let's see. It's got them skeleton man. Oh! Yes. I don't think I lost anyone else but the wolves, so. Summon the wolves, I guess. Oh yeah, these the skeleton men are so slow. Even with the sped up gameplay. Kinda weird. They just kinda slowly run at you and like, oh, we're gonna get you. They get shot. Ah! Charm the ring mace. Oh, that's something to use your rings for. Weld them to a pipe, and you have a ring mace or a club, a bling club. A blink pipe. Look, it's a giant egg. JK. It's a furnace. <laughs> That's where they cook their eggs. That I'm sorry. Oh, look, more crocos. But I can't get to them. Hey, and we're back to the thing. Let me in. Nice. Yeah, I gotta open the other door as well. Yeah, because it reset. There you go. Cool. I did it. The journey was long and arduous. Led me through the ground and back. Who's that? Well, that's just sand. But that was another structure. But I mean, how cool is this? You just visit the pyramids that are conveniently walled off by walls, <laughs> rocks, mountains. 
Oh look, an immortal is gone. Here's the one. You the You the man. Okay. Everyone needs a blade and a helm these days. Murderous mace of ability. That's trash. Trash. Whoa. Cool. God protect you. We'll give this guy the stuff we have. Our chests are spacious and secure. Spacious. Free. Didn't get my stuff, but I got the venom sack. Who needs the venom sack? What's the third you need? The bat fang? Only have one, so you're not getting the bat fang. That's a no. We have this. Oh! We do have Seth's Betrayal! Wow! Amazing! Cool beans! God damn it. One claw! Get the razor claw. Wait, do I even need this? Oh yeah. It's of the pad bonus. She There's nothing else gives pad bonus. Bye! Bye! Also I need the Stalwart Alliance. Where's the bookseller? The magic stuff. Well look, a mighty warrior from foreign lands. I'm sure you will find just what you are looking for. But yes. I didn't. Going. Bye. Do, 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 do. Sometimes it is hard to remember. The Let me out. Ah, the eye of chaos and the hand of balance. They combine to form the scepter of eternity, an artifact of great power. Now, let us make haste and perform the ceremony. Really? You didn't even give me full health? This is of Beast's wrath. Oh my god! You failed, boy! Why, this, this cannot Not be! Me. How could we fail? Oh All god. that we tried to accomplish has been in vain. It is clear to me that the gods cannot help us. We are now truly on our own. Ah, but we must never stop trying. The Telkin that has been rampaging through Egypt has ravaged a number of sites guarded by the Order of Prometheus. These sites hold powerful artifacts from the ancient war. Clearly the Telkin is looking for something. Because of the artifacts' mysterious powers, we of the Order have guarded the hidden sites for thousands of years. Now there is only one site that has gone untouched in all of Egypt. Uh, in my blindness, I ignored all this because I thought the gods would save us. I was truly a fool. You must go to the tomb of Ramses, the last sight in the Valley of the Kings. Head up the Nile to Thebes, and from there to the valley and the tomb. Look for signs of the Telkin's passage. <laughs> Whatever he's searching for must not fall into his hands. When you have accomplished this task, meet me in Thebes. Now that we cannot count on the gods to save humanity, we must count on our heroes. Go now! I guess he's not betraying us. And I guess alien technology has an expiration date. Hmm. Had you not already slain a Telkin, I would say all is lost. I was a fool. I put all my faith in help from the gods, but it was not to be. Go, warrior! Stop the Telkin! Go, warrior! Stop the Telkin! Call me Ramirez. I shall go. Take damage committed to health. Ooh. Oh, I forgot these. That's alright. Life leech. Do I want to stop the Telkin, though? X! We are actually close. This thing is a lot shorter than this thing. Look at this. Up, 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 up. Then it's four. <laughs> oh yeah, we're back in Memphis, but we're immediately going to this place. 
now. Going down to this thing, I think. Please. I'm not sure I want to get going on this though. Not not today. Yeah. I am I'm I'm done. I'm done for today, even though almost twenty-five, but that will be a positive start, I guess, for next time. Anyways, time for some resting. Sweet embrace of temporary death. The monsters are good for business, yeah. So come again. <laughs> the monsters are good for business. I agree. Good day. Anyways, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy. Look at that. One day we'll do this. This great game. Look at that. Some of these spears look so cool. I need to make a spear character next. Anyway, good day then. Bye bye.